Hello, brothers and sisters. This is Lisa, and I'm here to share a repost from Glinda Lomax. The title is Be Not Puffed Up, and this is originally from 2012. I want to talk to my people about the attacks on other Christians. My people are called to walk in love, yet many of you think nothing of attacking my prophets, apostles, handmaidens, and servants. Do you not know I see your heart as you do this? Do you think I approve of your vicious attacks? Do you not see the damage you are doing to my body? My people, the time has come for you to lay down the arms you have taken up against one another and use your weapons against the enemy of your souls. My people are busy fighting each other, and I desire they would fight the enemy instead. Why do you waste time arguing doctrine while my lambs go unfed? Why do you waste time pridefully believing you know all there is to know about my word when you know nothing about love and walking in my ways? Is it more desirous that you know my word or you walk in my ways? My children, stop arguing amongst yourselves. You live in a fallen world. You live amongst those who have been deceived by the enemy. You lie among the lost, the walking dead. Waste no more time jostling with each other. I desire you would reach out to the lost and hurting world around you in my love. I desire you would see the pain you have caused my little ones in the harshness of your words, for I do not consider it a small thing when you hurt one of my little ones. I say lay down your arms against other believers today, or you shall face my judgment in these matters. You shall face consequences in your own lives for the destruction you are causing with the harshness of your words. Be not puffed up in your knowledge of my word, but walk in my ways and be a light in the lost and dying world in which you live. Be not a clanging symbol in the ears of men, but a sweet savor of love to me instead. Do not go about sowing strife and calling it my work. For did I not say in my word where strife and envying is, there will be also every evil work? Why then do you think you do my work when you sow strife among your brethren? You err in pridefulness, my children. My face is against you in these matters, and you bring judgment upon your heads as you do them. Repent and turn from this wickedness. Repent and love the brethren as I have instructed you in my word. And that is the end of this message. I pray you all have a beautiful day in the Lord. God bless each and every one of you. And I will see you either next video or in the air.